Hey, you guys. Let me get past the noisy dryer really quick. We are starting our day out in a rush. And Jason's joining me today. Let me tell you what we're gonna do. All right, today we have quite a bit going on. I have all of our decorations for that party back here. The trees are folded down flat. The Santa hats are kind of stacked inside each cone. And I've got, oh crap. Oh crap. We forgot a table. We have to go back and get a table. How's that gonna fit in I, We have to make it fit. We have to move everything around. Oh crap. All right, so now we have the table and the griddle and the drink dispensers that we forgot. <laughs> so I'm glad we went back for the table. Um, we are setting up for our church's Christmas party today. It is tomorrow morning. What is that? Squeak. Kind of an awkward sounding squeak. A little rubber from the... Thing. Oh, it's the hydraulic. Because our car hydraulic went out in the back tailgate door. Because that's wonderful. Anyway, we're going to set up for our ward, or our church's Christmas party. And Jason's graciously <laughs> offered to help me. <laughs> Yeah, I was told. No, I signed you up. You're coming. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm not doing this unless you're helping me on Saturday or on Friday. So um, we are going to go set up at the church as much as we can. And then we have to go buy all the food at Costco for the party. I have to confirm with uh, my committee. The only thing I'm not uncertain about is how much bacon to get. <laughs> um, I you're can't not buy enough. About it, no, I am uncertain about it. I just don't know how much. So far, I think we've only spent half the budget, according to the calculations that I'm gonna buy. buy. A pig, dude. Get a gold I know. <laughs> I think we should use a, a chunk of the rest of the budget to buy more bacon. It will get eaten. That's what our day is today, and then um, we're gonna hopefully have pizza night, movie night with the kids that are left at home. Um, Kaylee wanted to have another movie night at the house with her friends, and I was like, nope, I can't handle that. I have to be up and out of the house by 7.15 tomorrow morning to go finish setting up, start people making pancakes and bacon, and be ready for this party with a whole slew of breakfast ready to go by 9 a.m. So, I don't want anyone over tonight. I just want to have us, and we have to clean the house for our family Christmas party on Sunday it's just a lot I want to just get to Sunday night <laughs> and be done with all this I know get done with the holidays no I just because us our family stuff makes me relaxed like the thought of just being able to like get to Christmas break play games watch movies go go hang out together and stuff that makes yeah, me that's like what the holidays are about oh I'm so glad I brought a battery because it's flashing <laughs> So we're gonna go to the church. I will show you, once we set up as much of it as we can today, I will show you what we've got and what we're gonna do. Okay, let's go. So I'm recording this in case Jason does end up falling. <laughs> It's not exactly the safest way to go, but we'll see what happens. All right, now we're at Costco. We'll show you what the church looks like in just a bit. But we are starting out with milk on the side for the activity. And then that's our side. I'm trying to get stuff for our Christmas party on Sunday and snacks for when the kids are home from school during break. So the family Christmas party. Our family Christmas party, yeah. This is our side. This is church's side. All right, next up is bacon. We are getting 18 of these four packs. So we've got some there, the and then two have. more down there. Okay, we've added two bags of pancake mix. Gives us about five, 600 pancakes. So I think that'll do it. Now we need syrup. All right, one for us, one for the church. Should do it? Should do it. All right, and because the hydraulic, this is what's wrong with the car. The hydraulic right here is broken. We have to hand hold the door. So I get to stand here while Jason unloads Costco. Hercules, Hercules. That's a movie reference, but I don't know if anybody will get it. Okay, you unload. I will hold the door. Bacon. Oh, milk. Milk. Two more milks. I'm getting the orange juice at the grocery store. This is what we got going on. I create a solid base. 
Make sure I get my Coke in there. We almost forgot to buy that. Everyone's like, wow, that is some good bacon you're buying. <laughs> That's a lot of bacon. Yep. So it's ready to cook in the morning. Okay, this horse is getting heavy, babe. It's getting kind of heavy. Oh, I might do it with my head. Get those delts. Work on those delts. Oh my now. gosh, it hurts. Hurry. I'm hurrying. It's like so heavy. Is it this one that's out right there? On that side? Uh, yeah, I think it's this one. So he got two of them. He's just gonna replace both of them. Are you gonna make me like, oh crap, it's falling. Whoa. I'm almost done, love. Hurry. Hurry. You get the yogurt, I'll get this. Oh, you get to hold it for one. I'm gonna just go really slow. Uh, work on my, uh, while I get my, this one thing of yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we haven't had a full Costco load Watch like that in a while. All right, so I look like a hot mess. The hair's already come up. You look fine. But um, now we have to go to the grocery store. The orange juice at Costco is so expensive. <laughs> we can get a gallon of milk for four dollars at the grocery store. A gallon of juice, you mean? No. Oh yeah, that's what I meant. Anyway, I would like to. Even though it's not my budget, I still like to stretch the budget as far as it can go. And I don't even think we're gonna spend all of the budget, which would make our bishop very, very happy. Yeah, you gotta stretch those righteous dollars. <laughs> Stop. That's another music reference there. See if an anyone catch one. him. That's an obscure one. If anybody knows what that's talking about, righteous dollars, there might be, a, I think there's two songs I'm thinking of. There's no, there's no reward. The yeah, but there's no reward. I'll be impressed. <laughs> I'll be impressed. You can think of a song that uses the lyric "righteous dollars." Um, Stealing righteous dollars. And then I still have to go back to Hobby Lobby and get more wrapping paper. We ended up having to set up more tables than we thought we were going to, but they're different size, and I ran out of wrapping paper to decorate with. So, gotta go back to Hobby Lobby, and I'm praying that they still have the. Can you? Click these stupid hydraulic things are in my way. Thank you. I hope they have the colors that I've already used. Um, you cannot clash red and white. I'm already in a mood. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, love. And you're half that mood. <laughs> no, if we got white and red, that'd be bad. Okay. I'm going to turn this off because he knows darn well I'm not in the mood <laughs> to deal with clashing colors. And people who don't know how to coordinate so we're just gonna leave it at that I want them to coordinate and I want it to go with a theme if you're gonna put me in charge let me do it right oh yes don't mess with me right now okay so they were all out of the actual gallons so we had to get like a bunch of these they were on sale but a little bit more than I wanted to pay but I'm kind of needing to just get it and be done. All right, so we got everything in the fridge here at the church. We've got some bacon here on the side. Oh, Jason doesn't want to let me show it. Oh, oh sorry. Okay. <laughs> we got the bacon and the milk <coughs> and the juices, and we're just trying to fit everything in here to make sure the fridge will still shut. Voila. Yeah? Okay. What's next? It is already time for the kids to get home from school. So Kaylee is getting... Ashley and Chelsea from the bus. Just gonna stage the pancake station right here. We've got one griddle here, and then we've got two more right here. Um, they're going to be bringing a couple more griddles and stovetop griddles as well. And then we're gonna bake the bacon. And I'm gonna bring trays for that tomorrow and, and then I'll show you. I'm gonna go set up some more of the um, uh, wrapping paper. I'm gonna go put more of that on the table because I ran out so I ran over to Hobby Lobby and I'll show you what we have for that. Someone is practicing at the piano inside the chapel if you hear her playing. This is the room we have set up. Oh don't, oh yeah. So it's not cute yet. Let me make it cute really quick. All right, in the food room, we've got a little start to the food table. We've got plates, napkins, 
and then <laughs> Jason, you did a marvelous job at putting the silverware in these cute little containers I just got at Hobby Lobby. They say Merry Christmas on, inside there, not that you can see that. But that's kind of cute, and then we did more of that table, or the wrapping paper down this table. This will be egg quiche dishes on this table and fruit platters. Then our pancakes and our bacon will go here in little <coughs> heating contraptions. I forget what they're called. I'm very tired. All right, if anyone's ever wondering if it's difficult to decorate a gym <laughs> for a Christmas party, it's very difficult to not make it look like a gym. But I think I've done a fairly good job. We did the white plastic table runner and then the wrapping paper down the center. I wish I had more of that green, but that's okay. And then we did the Santa hats and the trees staggering. We have room in here for 200 plus, I think. So I think it turned out pretty good. And Jason gave me some ambiance for the stage. Isn't that pretty? We added some trees and some lights up there. All right, so here on the stage, we added some trees and a little reindeer. And then there's my little string garland um, from the party store. And then my friend Holly had those lights that we hung up there. And then we're gonna put um, my big present, those two big presents that I have at home, they're gonna go right there and right here in the center. And then we wrapped up some other empty boxes and put them down here and another tree. And this little paper garland is super cute. I thought it was gonna to be too small, but it actually ended up being perfect. So we ran out of the long rectangle table, so we ended up having to add three round tables. So it wasn't exactly the aesthetic that I wanted to have, but we added some runners on these three tables as well as the trees. I had more of the trees than I had of the Santa hats, so it actually worked out perfectly. And a special thanks to that guy right there. I'm zooming in on you. Has been with me since 9.30 a.m. and it is now almost four. I'd like to say that we're done for the night. We're done here at the church. I've got some of the extra wrapping paper to wrap up a few boxes to put on the, the um, stage right there and then we'll bring those extra boxes, and then I've got a few other things to prep at home. But I'm, I'm tired and done. But it looks pretty good, don't you think? All right, we're finally heading home. I'm blitzed, I'm so tired. I could fall asleep in the car right now. It's 4.30, 4.15. I feel bad because poor Ginger probably hasn't had a chance to come today since we've been gone all day. She gets a little lonely when we leave, doesn't like to come out to play. Now I gotta go figure that out and get the kids. Kaylee's already off playing. Abby's friends want her to play, but... Um, I'm having trouble communicating with her right now. Yeah, she lost electronics yesterday. That's all we we'll to say about that. Yeah, <laughs> we won't go into that. But uh, I've gotta wrap more of the presents when I get home. We got Papa Murphy pizza, because I knew, I just knew it was gonna be a long day and I wouldn't wanna cook, so. We'll have pizza for dinner. I'm going to turn a movie on for the younger kids and hopefully have an easy night. And we're going to be up super early tomorrow. It'll be fun. I hope it all goes well tomorrow. I hope they have enough. I think once people are there, we're going to have enough people like making pancakes and making the bacon. It's just at this point, only one person has signed up to do bacon. Two people are signed up to do bacon. So. A little worrisome, but ooh, that's problem. good lighting. It's not your problem, so no. I mean, I did de I did decorations, and people will just leave it at that. I'm <laughs> I'm kind of done doing what I've needed to do. We'll make sure everything runs smoothly in the morning, but um, yeah. All right, we wanted to document Jason's quick. Oh yeah, I already got it done. Yeah, no, I I barely good. unloaded the groceries. And he has, oh, look at that. Look at that. Now, we don't have to replace this other one. Should we just hang on to this so in case it breaks? Yeah, let's let this one go as far as it will. And then if we sell the car, then we can just give that to him. It'll be a bonus. It's a bonus. bonus. Okay, thank you. And yes, you heard that right. I'm currently trying to sell my car. And I seriously can't wait. If you want to get wait. the car, go and buy it. Yeah, if you want a car, just kidding.
some of the kids want their pizza now. Others don't want it right now. Actually, Toothpaste, I don't anyone? Really want it right now since I'm gonna go play. You're gonna go play now? All right. Well, if they don't come back, or if I come back, then I'll probably want it. All right. Did Ginger come while I was gone? No. Well, maybe she was too lonely to come out while we were gone. Yeah. All right. Okay. Bye. And Ashley is down here on the couch. Abby's in the kitchen. Thank you, Jace. Yeah, yeah. I'm very tired, I'm very tired. Ashley, have we been lazy tonight? I have been here at my desk. Actually, I've been watching this um, series on Netflix called The Five. As I was doing paperwork, and I edited a video, and uploaded it. But it's been hours since we got home, and I've just been trying to rest and relax and get caught up here at my desk. What is this paper? Um, oh, Daddy read my mind. She wanted to have a movie night, but Daddy and Mommy kind of took over yeah. the TV and the computer. So we're letting them have a bowl of ice cream, and then they're going to bed. Um, looks like Jason... Rah! You yeah. can't scare me. <laughs> I knew you were in here with dad getting ice cream. Yeah. So nice try. And then it's bedtime. Because we got to get up close. early. Oh, well, I have to get up early. Yeah, you have to get up early. But they don't need to eat. And they don't need to get dressed. They're going to wear pajamas. Christmas jammies. To the party tomorrow. Can I just change into them? Since I know I'm going to get too hot at night. Yeah. But you can put them on I'll in the morning. I'll wear these and then I'll get them on in the morning. Yeah, do you know where they are? Are they upstairs? Okay, Jason hung the laundry. We're gonna sign off for tonight, and I will try and film tomorrow at the party. If I can, it'll probably be really chaotic, but we'll film as much of our day tomorrow as we can. And I hope you enjoyed today's video. It was really, it was really stressful today, to be honest. But we got a lot done, and we are ready for the party tomorrow, so. Come. Ginger has not come. This it's been one of those day. days, people. This whole day. Yeah. This whole day. Well, there's still time left in the day. Maybe she can still come. Take care, guys.